Hi, Funky Wolf. I'm not too late today, haha. <laughs> nice. Hello, Watcher. Hi, Song Gale. Hi, Prime. Kitty, yes, the kitty is here. She wanted the attention. And I think this stream we're going, well, well for one, I gotta get the silly goober drawings out of the way. I gotta get Philip's sad face drawings finished for like a silly little guy's thing. And then it's just a whole bunch of Wally drawings because I feel like I haven't been drawing enough of him. Look at all your lovely fans, kitty. Alright, kiss your fans goodbye. Okay. Yeah, I had just been drawing my Wally AU. Nice. I have my bunny on my lap right now. Oh, cute! On my TikTok, I made a character cartoon on wood, and I paint, and I would make a video about Tink Wally on a wood, please. Could I make Tink Wally video about on wood, please? Okay. I don't know what that means, but alright. <laughs> let's just get to it. Yeah, let's get the silly goober sad Philip faces out of the way. Where did my pen go? Hi, Wolfheart! you change your name. Yeah, it's, it's just Wolfheart now. So how are you guys this Friday? Good, my stomach hurts. Uh, make sure you lay down and take good care of yourself. I'm happy it's Friday and I've done nothing, and I finally have nothing planned. Nice. I feel worse. What about you? Uh, not terrible. Just slightly nervous because finals are coming up. Finals coming up, school projects that need to be finished at a certain time and manner. I burned a hot pocket. I'm happy about it. <laughs> nice. Hi, so you have the plan from beginning was for this channel to be something to my channel, my current hyperfixation into the arc animations part. Took that away. Okay. Spend the entire day doing nothing. Hope you do well on them. Thank you, Violet. I hope I do well too, because I don't want to repeat classes. I 
And I gotta pull up a, a reference because consistency. How are you feeling in your classes right now? I'm doing fine. I'm just crawling by at this point. I'm just more mostly worried about my Spanish class because I need a C in order to pass. If I have a C minus, I can't move on to the next level. And I'm on a I'm on a I think normal B right now. It could be B minus right now. I'm not too sure. But I do have, all right, I gotta, I have storyboarding class, whoops, okay. I have intro to storyboarding class. I have intro to animation class. I have indigenous aesthetics class. And theater 101. I hope you have time to breathe and go about your work as best you can. Mm -hmm. I'm doing the best I can. I do have rules for myself. Like, if I'm at school and I have just time to work on it, I will hold you homework. But if I'm at home doing homework, after like 4 p.m., I stop doing homework. So, yeah, that's my mental health rule. If it's past 4 p.m., no more homework. No more homework. I'm doing bass and vocals. Oh, nice. For today's film news, journalists are calling the new emotion in outside Inside Out 2 a bold move for Pixar. Nice. I mean, I see a lot of promotional art for them. I only recognize anxiety, though. I don't know about the other ones. They put my name in the movie and my name is spelled different. Oh, nice. Huh, I remember going to a daycare that also teaches theater as a kid. Hmm, that's cool. I only took Theater 101 because I needed for a writing intensive, and so I just picked that one. It was my great uncle's house to eat there with him. Fortunately, I lost one of my earbuds in his place. Oh, I hope you find your earbuds. toddler and called me and called a baby monkey and my mom got mad I was a toddler and I called a baby monkey interesting I see fans saying it's either this will be interesting or it's unnecessary sequel hmm we had to put back we had to put back at his place my father is finding it for me okay Oh, hi, cosplayer girl.
Do you hate when people trace your art? Trace your art that you work so hard on and don't credit for it. If that happens to you, I'm sorry to hear that. Um, as for me, I never had my art traced. Although I did have someone randomly take my art. In, Wa in Wattpad, someone wrote a story and they, I guess, they just took my character, one of my characters. And said, this is what MC looks like. And they did not credit me. But I wasn't too bothered at the time, and I'm still not really because, I don't know. I just don't really care too much. I don't know why I don't care that much. Maybe I should, but I guess not. <laughs> oh, cosplayer, what, what am I doing? I just find it fast to say your name that way. <laughs> And what's going on? Um, I'm drawing Sad Phillips because Silly the Guy wants to do a fun little project with a certain audio. And it involves his character and my character. My character is very sad throughout the whole thing though, so I'm drawing Sad Phillips. But after the Sad Phillips, we're drawing, I'm going to be drawing a whole bunch of Wallies because I feel like I have not been drawing him enough. So long as they don't do it constantly, I'm glad you don't worry too much about it. Yeah, as far as I know, it was a one-time thing. But I'm just not personally bothered by it, I don't know. <laughs> Which, funny enough, the character they took was also a bird character like Philip. I wonder if I still have him around. I don't think I do. Darn it. Give me a sec. I'm in trouble with my father for sure. It was my pot. It was in my pocket the whole time I made I made him pull up to my uncle's house for no reason. <laughs> oh wow. Hi Swift. Oh, I have so much to dig through. Uh oh, okay, where'd it go? Jeez, I have a lot to dig back. Oh, found him. I almost finished my pilot. I just need to do two more minutes long. It's almost one minute. Nice! Congratulations, Swift. This is the character that was low-key taken. this one that was taken pretty wings yeah so there was this one apparently they also wanted to make a twisted wonderland character x reader story on wattpad so they took these pictures let me 
There's so many old drawings I had that I don't ever return to. <laughs> That outfit looks similar. Yeah, Twisted Wonderland. I did have one more other. I do have a few Twisted Wonderland characters. I just never got around to finishing them all too much. There was this one. I just like how cool her hair is. <laughs> It's gotta go. Nice hanging out with you. Bye, Wolfheart. Thanks for hanging out. Then there was this one. She's cool. She was low key inspired by a, a poo from Aladdin. Yossi's have great tails. I just love tails for some reason. <laughs> Abu, Abu, sorry. Yeah, this she was inspired by Abu. Am I late? No, we didn't start not too long ago. We only started 18 minutes ago. Abu from Aladdin. Yeah, she was inspired by that. Also, I had a delay on my episode instead of it April to June 26. Take all the time you need to make sure your pilot turns out great. Then there's this one. My mermaid character. Yeah, <laughs> I feel like I could do better now, but I just thought she looked funny because she kept her cap even as a human. She's like, I'm gonna wear this cap well and proud no matter the judgmental look I'll get. <laughs> Jellyfish, yeah. And then there was like one more. I'm gonna see if I can find him though. Hmm. No, I don't think I can find him here. Then there was there's this one. Does the cap still sting like a jellyfish? Not the cap. But if she were to hold out her hand and touch you and she felt like stinging you, she could. And she's a box jellyfish, so you know that stuff's gonna hurt. She kind of reminds me of the jellyfish lady from Naza Born Again. Reborn. Oh, okay. Yeah, the, the, tea, the teapot mouse. So we got this tiny little student who's in this dorm. And oof, if she didn't like you, she'd poke you and then boom. Pain. Oh yeah, she's in the Octavinel dorm, so you could imagine the amount of people she had to shock. Also, if you scan some of my oh, QR codes in my short spur. Okay. That's neat. The lion mane jellyfish can give you an allergic reaction. That's scary. <laughs> Uh. <laughs> Let's go back here. Dun, 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 dun. 
Guess I can't find anything else. Get back to work. You'll find audios about the lore of my show. Okay, nice. Do you like group calls? Do you like group calls on Discord or no? If I know you in person, I'm more willing to do group calls, but if it's people online, I'm a little bit more hesitant, even though I do want to do that one day, because there's so many fun games on Discord that for some reason I can't do online normally. Yeah, sorry, Watcher. I take, like, online safety very seriously, that's why. Which is why I stay away from jellyfish. Even if, if I'm ever on a beach again. Not that I've been stung before. I ever planning on it. <laughs> I got stung one time. I got stung by a blue man of war one time. It it hurt. <laughs> Hi, Issa Dragon. I have to go. Adios. Oh, bye, Velvet. Hi, Riza. I just wanted to let everyone know that I won't be able to join today. All right. You what? Yeah, I got stung by a jellyfish before. The main villain of my show is Tafos. He's a clone of Swift, who used to be a serial killer. Hmm, okay. I'm going to remake some old animations I did in the past, like the Neverland Kelly, Roxine, Tango, Angst. <laughs> I grabbed a stringless jellyfish and I ran around with it on the ocean. It's a man of war. Um, we have the blue jellyfish, the blue man wars. They wash up on shore once in a while. And it wasn't a big one either. I was boogie boarding, and I think I may have surfed past it with my leg in the water, and it may have like wrapped around my leg, ankle a bit. I didn't feel it until after I got out of the water. So it probably was a small man of war, that's why. So yeah, that was the one time I got stung by a jellyfish. But yeah, no, sometimes those things, like, wash up on shore. Unless you... I'm not- I know they can be dangerous, I just know if they're the big ones in the deep ocean, they're deadly. But the tiny ones, they just hurt. Do you have a scar? No, I don't. It did scar, initially. But I think it faded. I think I got it better than my cousin, who had a very long, obvious scar from stinging. Well, probably your brain wasn't reacting. Maybe. Or I had just too much stuff going around that I just did not notice at the time. I got trampled by them. I had to sit on an ice cube. Mm. Oh yeah, also, from what I learned, peeing on jellyfish stings does not help. It only makes it worse, so if you get stung by a jellyfish, don't, don't pee on it.
I feel lucky I wasn't stung by a jellyfish ever. Yeah, count yourself lucky that you never got stung. I just sit on an ice cube and I look like a plum. Oof, that sounds painful. If someone peed on me because of a jellyfish thing, I'd rather deal with the sting. <laughs> no, it's like a... It's like a myth, legend, or like a false little thing people would say. Like, if you get stung by a jellyfish, to make it hurt less, you pee on it. But apparently that's not true, it just makes it worse. <laughs> But then I haven't swum in the ocean a long time. Yeah, again, if someone offered because they thought it would help, I would be running the other way. <laughs> I don't want to be peed on, but I'd rather be laying on the sand dealing with the pain other than getting peed on. <laughs> if I ever got stung by judges that I refuse to have anyone pee on me, <laughs> I'm glad, but I'm glad that's a myth. <laughs> well, I think sadly at the time we didn't have baking soda, and again, baking soda I don't think helps either. It's probably just best to stick the sting back in the ocean, I hear people say. We all don't want to be peed on. I mean, <laughs> I'm gonna, okay, I'm gonna about to embarrass myself. I'm pretty sure when I was little and I did get that sting, I just went to the bathroom and I, it was on my leg, so I just did it on myself, so. <laughs> I was a dumb kid, but. I just thought that's what you're supposed to do, and my parents said, yeah, if you get stung on it, just get stung, just, just pee on it. <laughs> At least no one peed on me, but I did it myself, alright. <laughs> Who brings baking soda to a beach? Uh, some other people say baking soda helps, peeing in baking soda. So, I don't know. <laughs> you seriously just peed on you? Yeah, well, I thought I was a kid. And the, and the adults were saying, yeah, if you get stung by a jellyfish, to make the pain go away, just pee on it. And I did. <laughs> I don't remember if it helped or not, but I guess, like, the placebo effect, where if you think it works hard enough, it'll mentally affect you and you think it's working, maybe that's what happened. There has to be something that actually helps. That's bad. <laughs> I don't want to smell like pee. I mean, I washed it off in the ocean, so at least I didn't smell like it afterwards. But yeah, I hear people say nowadays, if you get stung, just stick your leg back in the ocean. It's still funny. It, yeah. That's understandable. I had a couple of accidents as a kid. So yeah, if you get stung by a jellyfish, just stick stick your stick it back in the ocean. Don't don't pee on yourself or have someone pee on you. <laughs> Same. I had extremely weak bladder. <laughs> Have you ever got poked in the ocean and you picked it up and it was a shell? And you look inside of it and there was a little leg sticking out? It moved a little because that happened to me. Hmm, sounds like a hermit crab. I remember when you go to the tide, when I, there's tide pools around the island. I'd just go to the tide pools and we'd hunt for hermit crabs.
and I did write a story. You know the jellyfish girl I showed you? I do have two fanfic stories with her in it. Short stories. I remember stepping on a shell to go into the deep ocean in the shell. It was really submerged in the sand, but man, did it hurt. Have you ever heard of Neopets? I've heard of Neopets, but I never had Neopets. Like the one time me and my mom and my older sister were going out to eat, we got stuck in traffic, and then my old my child bladder decided we need to go, and I tried to hold it till we got to Dick Sports. <laughs> I feel I fell back into the ocean so far. My auntie saw me and said, "What did you throw?" I said, "A curb, a curb that poked me." Mm. I felt- I feel like screaming. Hmm. I wonder if there are any songs I can play that won't get me in trouble. In the end, I couldn't hold any longer and went my sister's trunk seat and we pulled over to Dick's sports and my mom got a new pair of shorts but they didn't but they didn't have any undergarments so my mom <laughs> Sorry, I'm distracted by a short. I want to see what is it. How many people live here? Me and my mom. So two. My dad. Three. Died. Two. You wasted my time a little bit. <laughs> Who's Sterling? Oops, that's not what I meant to hit. Stop overpaying for sunglasses. It's crazy that the most expensive thing you're wearing is... Can I send group chat a drawing I did? If you have Discord, you can. There's a new forum, too called the art show where you can show art stuff but make sure it's safe for work stuff please hi pride squad got a bikini bottom as an undergarment instead I don't know how to feel back then, but then again, my mom did say bikinis are like undergarments. They kind of are. Just very- oh no. Swimsuits are not waterproof. But they do what they do, they cover the bits, and thus it's an undergarment.
That's what my mom said one time. <laughs> I sent it. Okay. My pirate phase is back and getting ready to animate my pirate series. Okay. I'm gonna, I'm just gonna go not really paying attention to the live stream anyways, which I hope you guys are having a wonderful day. Bye, Issa Dragon, have a nice day, or night. Also, I wish I had a bit more, more text time, because that took me a bit to type. <laughs> to go. Good night, everyone. Good night, Pride Squad. Oh man, the distress Philip is in right now. <laughs> I need to turn down this music. It's loud on my end. You're in time to see a stream of sad Philip drawings. I pet that of stress bird. <laughs>
My back hurts. Well, make sure you go lay down. Feels like going on bricks. I'm sorry to hear that, Watcher. faces <laughs> hmm. but by the way Alice why are you drawing Philip sad because silly little guy wants to do a collab video and the audio is essentially um his oc phobos saying alongside something like oh my gosh what he did now alex is not gonna love you i'll be his favorite and philip is like oh my gosh i'm gonna lose my best friend's favor forever time to cry <laughs> so does philip still have cough cop special magazines around his mansion like looks at Philip. Not anymore. He's matured. He's matured a bit. If anything, it's just novels, adult novels that you have to read. It's not magazines. <laughs> he matured from that. Still not good. Still not good, but still. He's matured a bit, not a lot. Is a bit of a is a bit sus, my guy. Uh, I guess you could say he's sus for that, but I don't know. <laughs> Philip looks like a baking guy. Uh, he has his machinery make cake for him. 
So I guess kind of. He just went, did, wouldn't do it himself. I see him more of a, as a Mark Rover kind of guy. Like, constantly trying to make stuff to make, I guess, way of life easier for some. Mostly it's just the people he cares about and himself. He ain't a full baker. No, he ain't. He'll make machines that will do the baking for him. I see a little guy. Oh yeah, and I'm doing... I'm finally getting my collab pieces done for you. So, here are my slides so far. You made him cry, silly little guy. How could you? <laughs> I'm doing the outlines for it, but I can send you mine. Hold on. <laughs> I'm not really doing any finalized. I'm doing more sketchy, sketchy kind of art. Who's crying? Also, hello everyone. Hello, Melissa. Philip is crying. I think I need to make this lower. Match. 
I'm sending it as a GIF because I haven't done. I have. I don't have the storage to set an individual PNGs. Also, are we coloring this? I'm gonna make it easier on us and say we don't have to. react to someone putting glue and glitter on the feathers of his face while he's sleeping. He will disintegrate them. No one messes with his hair or his friends. Alright, now I want to hug Philip to make him feel better. <laughs> I sent it. Okay. on Alex. Yeah, Alex would disintegrate you. No one messes with his hair. <laughs> ah, I see it. Nice silly little guy. Time to send the commissions. Oh, you finally gotta send in the commission? Alright. Yeah, I'm pretty sure glitter and glue in feathers would be impossible. Or very difficult to get out. commission a commission is when you pay an artist to draw certain things for you depending on what it is sometimes it's just drawing OCs and the artist's style or wanting to draw a specific ship seen in the artist's style or just wanting an artist to draw your ship you can do that if you find someone if you find an artist who has commissions I think I'm doing commissions for Roblox in VR chat. Oh, nice! It's okay.
Hugs, Philip. Yeah, I make I'm making Philip super super sad. <laughs> stays there. Why are you back flipping to face plant? I live for five seconds and someone backflip face planted. I have no idea. Here we go. Besides heartbreak fill up. Uh, Watcher's doing his Watcher things. I think this one's my favorite. <laughs> Yeah, my son would turn into a giant wolf. I don't know, they're like crying, Philip. Looks with the tears, aw. I'm sorry if it takes a while on this. I have a bad habit of procrastinating. It's okay, I've also been procrastinating on this too. So you're not the only one. <laughs> What just happened? I got kicked out? Okay. Well. well, I'm sending these your way, silly little guy. And also, yeah, I also did these faces too. While I was out. <laughs> Still on the floor. <laughs> oh, 
All right. Now to a whole bunch of Wally drawings. Let's see if there's any Wally drawings I just have not finished. Because I have stuff like that. You know what? Let's do the tried and true pair. I also wanted to dip my toes a little bit back into the Roger Rabbit AU that I kind of handed over to Wolfheart but still kind of want to dip my feet in. Because there's this song I found that I really want to animate to. Is it okay if I describe? How the commission would be like, or what, or what I'm about to ask it might be a bit too detailed or too simple. Do you have Discord, Melissa, or are you okay with communicating through email? Why well, didn't know you gave Roger Rabbit away? Well, I kind of low key gave it away, not necessarily like I will never work on this ever again, but. More like, hey, if you want to work on this AU and turn it to whatever you want it to be, go ahead. I might just dabble in it here and there. Yes, I do have Discord. Are you in my chat? You are you in my uh, chat? Not the chat. Uh, sorry, I can't brain I'm brain farting right now. Are you in the Starlight Cafe server? In a way, yeah. Are you in the? Starlight Cafe Server Club. The Hazel. Okay. Okay. So, let's see. Is it still too late or too early for you to chat after this? Because we can reschedule it to another time where it's a little bit more convenient, because I know it could be late for a lot of people, even you, so we could reschedule it a little later, if you'd like. And by the way, this is the song I wanted to animate it, made this little thing to, for the Roger Rabbit at you, because I think it's cute and funny. I'll be going to send anyway, I'll keep the info just in case. Okay. Because I'll look over your stuff, and then we'll discuss prices and how I'll handle things. And this is also where I get to chat with you, and you can tell me in person, well, through Zoom slash Discord to server chat, what we're looking for. Yeah, Melissa, if you want to do a commission, make sure to send it through because I'm trying to look for your uh, response. I can't find it. I'm planning on getting Discord once I get a laptop. Nice. 
And as for a watcher who's still on the floor, let's see if this will work. Well, let me DM real quick. Okay, I'll send the link in here. Password. To corners pop at night. Pop corners. For those that cats meow. Of course. It's because they're pop. Knock yourself out. Delicious. What is he doing? Bro, I said dress like a cop busting a speakeasy. I thought you told me it was a sleepeasy. And that made sense to you? <laughs> Standing on the sidelines waiting for a chance to speak up And whenever it is my turn, I will say Well, I don't really know what it means to have the spotlight And the more I think about it, I'm afraid Cause I measure out my worth and put it on the line But never give too much so I'll stay fine If I'm disappointing you Then where does that leave me? I know that I should stand tall And want more But I sat on the floor I found the same art tool you're using. By the way, I found the same art tool you're using on the TikTok shop. Oh, okay, nice. drawing him because it's time to return back to Neverland for a little bit and I want to draw a little portrait of with uh, Wally and YN because that's because that's what most of the fandom I am in is So once I get enough money from the li from the lives I do, I can finally get a digital art. Nice. I find it funnier drawing my pan. I am literally working on my Wally redraw. Thanks, animation. <laughs> Get out of the awkward silence and just play some music. I'm gonna see if I can find any other pictures of Wyan Pan I have. 
Because I, I don't know, did I draw them as individuals other than this one time? No, weirdly enough, I only ever drew them, like... It's sent, okay. Yeah, so these are the only times I ever drew Boyan as, like, an individual. Weirdly enough. This is my only reference I have of him. <laughs> I'll send the character reference of character sheet. Okay. Takes out my simp book and writes down my hand pan. Kept from forgetting to add him. It's been a while since I've- actually no, I technically have two YNs who are more on the smug side. That's YN Pan and like, actor YN, or Toon YN. I know I gave actor Wyan a name. What did I name him? I low key forgot. Give me a sec, guys. Oop. Oh, Scout. Yeah, Scout. cry. Hmm. Also, my line wide is inconsistent. I'm so sorry. It's okay. Yeah, so I'm excited to try draw Scout again. So in the Roger Rabbit little video I'm gonna make, the puppets of Welcome Home and the tunes are being paid kind of to make a PSA kind of video about how tunes, puppets, and humans must get along. But it's the kind of PSA where they're just t telling the kids to be nice. But the adults still kind of don't really follow or listen. So it's kind of like a... Kind of like those PSAs where it's like you can tell it's kind of propaganda-ish. 
but no one really takes it seriously or believes it. But this is where we see more of actor while he's a little bit slowly but surely falling for this person. <laughs> and you, they're not entirely oblivious. They do playfully tease with his feelings a little bit but don't really act upon it. <laughs> Wait, I just realized what happened in that comic since a moment ago. It's just nice as a boy. Put on a shirt, little brother, your simps on you. <laughs> I can't. <laughs> That smile I can't faint. <laughs> oh, I see Annie is happy to see uh, Pan again. Well, there goes Annie, yep. Nice. Seriously, my pen. Do you know how many people fall for that shirtless muscle man now and then? <laughs> Sadly, Annie, Wally's gonna have to say this individual is his. No one else can have him. <laughs> I'll fight him. <laughs> Possessive Tank Wally in the house. Yeah. I still have yet to get to that TikTok I said I was going to do. Darn it. Um, it's the one where Wyan Pan sneaks back into the home tree. And Wally intercepts him, and he's like, Where have you been? And he shoot and he does the uh, Weasley line of basically saying, No note, car gone, bed empty. You could have been seen, you could have died. Yeah, 
You have so much going on, TikTok can wait. <laughs> I sent you a thing on Discord. Oh boy, what'd you send? <laughs> Aw, cute. Yeah, Fubbles better apologize to little Philip because he made the guy cry. <laughs> So I gotta check something. Okay. Melissa, if you're still there, is it okay if we try I try to talk to you over Discord so I can get more details? Also just to get a feel of like, okay, this is what you're feeling. Separates everyone is fighting enough. Chorus to all of you. Oh boy, what's that doing? He's asking for it. No, he has his hand on his cheek. Oh, Tinkwa, I love you, but count your days. <laughs>
think I need And there we go. It's been a while since I last draw on <laughs> Hawaiian pan. fabulous well done thank you i'm glad my pan has improved over the years and now he looks pretty decent i'd say semi-attractive himself <laughs> Hopefully I'll get these guys colored and posted so I can forever memorialize this. I think that'll be it. Oops, Pan and Wally. Aw, cute. Yeah, Melissa, if you're still there, is it possible that we can discuss on Discord? Bye. Bye, Sangale. Bye. Bye bye, silly little guy. Goodbye, Prime. Bye, Funky Wolf.